I'm Steve Stewart and I'm the co-founder of Dreamloop Games. This is Vilay Kaunisto and he's one of my fellow co-founders. We're a Thumbaday Finland based independent game development studio that has just released Stardust Galaxy Warriors on Xbox One, PlayStation 4 and PC. Development is now underway on our next title, Challengers of Kalia, which is a tactical fantasy role-playing game. Gameplay in Challengers of Kalia is divided into roughly into these three sections resting on top of these three powerful pillars of management, exploration and turn-based tactical combat. Exploration is one where you go around, you have this caravan of sorts, you travel the realm, go into different cities, challenging their teams, you explore, you encounter various events that you react to, you can hire new gladiators, you can do things for your staff, these little quests that will make them happier, make them more better at their jobs. And that's pretty much what exploration is about. And then you have the management where you allocate resources to your staff, you interact with them, and, and you make sure that your team runs sm as smooth, smoothly as a well oiled machine, basically. Your players are equipped, they're happy, and such. And basically, the, the staff, uh, as, as can be seen from these two pillars, is in a very pivotal role. This is not a game about the gladiators themselves necessarily. This is a story oriented game where the narrative is delivered through the staff. The staff is the one. That, uh, experiencing it and uh, that's that's pretty much one of the major things that uh, you might not expect from a game like this but that indeed is a thing in terms of Kalea. The most important members of your staff will actually be your scout who will bring you information about various teams that you're set to face who you might not know all that much about except for perhaps their name. Um, once you get this information you can use it to tailor your strategy, really craft your, your tactical plan and then go into this five-on-five -five turn based combat. But right before you get in there, your scout may come to you and say, whoa, we had this all wrong. These guys have a ton of archers. We need to get some shields up. We need to change our strategy. We need to really flip this thing over and see how we can win. And all of this is actually already in engine. It all works and we are currently in process of polishing it, of adding content, replacing placeholders with non-placeholders. We'd love to get feedback from the community and we'd love to get feedback from potential publishing partners so we can know how we can make this a step above, how we can take this just a bit higher. We know that we have a great game on our hands uh, because we're in love with the concept, but how can we make this a game that will be a fan favorite for years to come? How can we make this a shared vision that everyone will love, not just us. That's why we're here today. Give us some feedback and help us along on this path and maybe help us come up with a strong partnership to make this game even better. Thank you. Thanks. Thanks.